You know, we uh, we live in a very uh, opportune society now, a society where we can start over again. And what I'd like to do is have uh, my friend to my right uh, have a little chat with both of you in regards to some important topics that we feel should be uh, spread around. So the floor is yours, dear. Well, as you know, it's a time of an infection, yes. Um, you've seen these biting people coming around. I'm just going to check perimeters. The government has Give it out. Yeah, sure, if you want to do the same. Basically, we're just ensuring that all free people remain free and aren't tethered to bullshit government patriarchal ideals. Are you two gentlemen free? I'd have to say so. Free as the wind. That is excellent. That is good news. We don't like to see anyone being oppressed in this new era. This new dawn of freedom that has been given to us. We've spent years, well, maybe not everybody, but me at least. Um, well, let me ask you this. When I say the word anarchism, what comes to mind? Chaos. And you, good sir? I guess, uh... I really don't know. It's just a disorganized sense of uh, establishment. Well, I can understand uh, why both of you would say I guess that. I don't think about it much. Well, now is the time to probably Can I ask you something? About it. Well, yes, of course. Are you an ar anarchist? Possibly. Does, would that offend you? Oh, no, I'm just... I'm curious. I'm... Uh, I don't affiliate in, with anything politically, really. I'm just curious. Is there really I find anything that kind of politically thing to affiliate with? Well, that's I mean, isn't the whole, everybody right now living in anarchy? That's the whole point, my friends, is there are several preconceived fucking ideas about anarchism. Would you believe that Karl Marx himself, who wanted a state and classless free society, right? We all learned that in fucking third grade history class. Um, it, it was a great idea not having any classes or a state to make you bend the knee. However, he had one thing wrong, and that was that you needed a huge government to enforce such an idea. But now that the whole world has crumbled, in a sense, we're free to travel as small bands of people in a true anarchist society, which in its true definition is a direct democracy. So me and my friends that you saw that were behind me. I don't, I don't want to interrupt you, but you got to get Hey there, guys. Marco. You. Sound you muted. Know. Say that again, good sir. You have a guy running up behind you in the field. He's coming this way. Yep, he's coming right up. I don't know if you know him or not, sorry. No, I don't Didn't mean to interrupt you. It's okay. So basically, we're building a new society in this new dawn of Chinoris. And in that society, every man, woman, child, maybe not child, we probably have to vote on a age limit, but I don't know about you guys, but I haven't seen many children around lately. <laughs> no, sadly no. No, so the true meaning of anarchism is not to create chaos, it is just to ensure freedom and to ensure that every person is equal. So if either of you gentlemen, just as an example, What's your name there, joined friend? our free society like and say we had to take a vote on, um, I don't know, what demolished town to live in, each of your votes would be equal. There would be no chaos. Well, I'm confused. Are you okay? If you're an anarchist, you vote for equality? 
Yes, that is the true definition of anarchism. What you believe is anarchism from your past has been instilled upon you through the educational systems of a tyrannical government who has most likely I can barely understand what you're saying. convinced you that you have these oh, liberties God. and freedoms, but in reality, you are just cattle, a crop, if you it's will, to the rich yeah. and powerful who are put there through bullshit democracy. Um, you don't look like a Can I ask another question? Of course. Um, do you have any, like, n on, I mean this with no okay. offense, but do you have any formal education? Um, I take mild offense to that. To to war. Because you're basically I really don't that mean I sound it. like a crazy person. However, no, 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 that, uh, that's not what I mean. I just, I just want to know if you're... Like, definition of anarchism is the same as mine. Well, like I said, yours is. Okay, your well, definition I mean, has been created I mean, through years of a patriarchal at? government who doesn't really give a shit about you except for what they can get from you. But and to, to take and feature of that same government you hate. Your first question there my mother was a professor in Boston at a prestigious so university and she was head of the Boston anarchist movement. Unfortunately, uh, being a native of this land, she got terminally ill with cancer and we returned here. I understand. I'm sorry for your loss. Shit happens. She got to see the crumble of what we would have called society, yes, and through me, I get to help build, as it were, a true free society of free and equal human beings. And we're not here to, to convince you or preach or sound like some crazy religion. However, we just wanted to ensure that you do not belong to some disgusting government group or organization or religious faction that wishes to oppress the great free people of this land. Are you fucking with me right now? Oh no. Me? No, of course not. I'm I'm from the United States. Alright, and uh I came here as uh like kind of furthering my education, but it didn't work out, and I tried making myself my way east, and uh, I got stuck here. And now I'm just trying to make the best of it. I'm like, I have no problem with uh, your group or anything like that, but I would rather stay independent. Yes, as I said, um looking to convert you overnight or anything. We what just you, want uh, to ensure that your yourself. minds remain free Friend. from any oppressive outside well, force, yes? We don't really call ourselves and if you thing. remain free and not yeah. banding together with Rick some Luther, corrupt bullshit organizations, then well, we can remain friends at the very least, yes? Mm. You, could you tell yeah. me what anarchy yeah, is? An anarchism? Anarchism is the thought that you go around, you look at the notion, and yes, that what are you do? Inject me with the people can govern themselves by themselves. They do not need a huge organization to tax them or to create all these bullshit well, needs and wants that they need. They just made up govern themselves to, through uh, a direct democracy. Label me as and I know that, that sounds strange, yes, I've, yeah. I've been talking this point since I was a little girl. Thanks, Mom. But it um, really is... Sorry, but zombies are... It, it's really disturbing. Have to you real quick. Uh, it just seems like there's a lot of uh, holes. Uh, like? Well, you 
I don't like, you know, democracy and the other governments and such, but then you use the same system that they use of voting. No, democracy is is good. Democracy is, is free because it means your vote so you're pro democracy is my vote yes a direct um, democracy i'm not talking about without a true government I ran into a few of those people before and they're kind of dangerous but... i mean did you really but of course you'd have heads of this you'd have heads of this anarchism no group. no no that's communism everybody's equal yes by having no so i could join and kick you out say that again so I could join and kick you out? If everyone else in the group decided that yes. Well, that's communism that everybody has to agree in. Right, but communism takes a huge government to enforce its rules. So you technically vote that, hey, killing other people for fun is not allowed. And instead of just policing your own, as it were, you expect these power-hungry policemen to keep order for you. Hey, well, Does power you your life absolutely, yes? Little, uh, crazy. Uh, I think maybe instead of, you know, back to the old world of democracy and communism and anarchism, maybe you just want to, you know, create out? your own thing and uh, not follow labels and titles that were previously established. I mean, if there's okay, nothing so out here. There's no political there. groups. There's no capital. Whole, uh, you can make your government, your system, whatever you want. I've heard start. words of the maker people who praise some made-up god. And don't get me wrong, in anarchism, you're free to follow any god you want. That is, you know, we're not oppressive like that. However, religion especially made up cults who run around and cut into your fucking physical body whether you're a follower or not that is oppression and that is not acceptable yes or the communists who run around and who i've heard i have not witnessed this personally and i do not mean to disrespect anybody of course but They've heard, I've heard stories that they've kidnapped people, and, you know, if I kidnapped you and I was a communist, I would, or these guys that say they're communists anyway, would kill you should you not convert to communism. Having other political ideals is completely acceptable. Oppressing free people with your ideals and forcing them on other people is not acceptable. Oh, don't worry. I think I anyone could agree around. to that, yes. Of course. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, can I ask a question here? Of course. Right, we're free to go. Yeah. We can just walk away, right? Mm. Here's the thing. As far as I'm concerned, there were some friends of mine that were. Uh, at, I'm gonna uh, keep. I'm ahead of the colony hangs out or used to. You right, can join me if you want me, if you want me to. All right, yeah. yeah. Um, first, let me... Can I ask your name, please? Because I Cheryl. actually would love to run in... Cheryl... Cheryl Gray, Gray right? Yes. yes. Okay. Well, I would absolutely love to run into you again, because I would like to discuss politics and whatever with you. I'm edgy. I'm educated myself. I studied at the uh, University of Michigan. And it's always nice to conversate with somebody else who is knowledgeable in such things. Yes, I would like that very much. And as I said, both of you are definitely free to go. We're not going to hold anybody up and yeah, force our ideas true, on you by any means. We just hope that you go in peace and as free people, people and should anyone try to oppress you, you let us know, huh? It was his blood. Oh, definitely. Do you have a name for your group or anything like that? Um, we're not an actual society yet. We're working on building one. However, you can find us on a specific radio station. Let me jot it down for you real quick. 
All right. Well, there you go, good sir. All right, thank you. Well, I'm gonna head off with Taj here. Um, hope to your on and see you guys again. Yes, stay free, gentlemen, stay free. Right, good luck, you two. What Have a safe journey, doing? remember. Just get oppressed by those wrong people. Stay free. Right. You yep, that, uh, you guys too. Good luck. Affected.